That is pakoda. It's so good. There you go. Yalla. Masala chai. Wow. Wow! Paneer. Uh, paneer gar masala. Tikka masala. Tikka masala. That tums in now viral. Which chutney do you like the most? The green one. Like it. Delicioso. I will give a 9 out of 10. I'll give it a uh, good 5.37 out of 9. Hola! Hola, hola, hola! Hola, 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 buddy! How are you? Welcome to Jerusalem. Do you remember this guy? Hola! Honey. Amazing. How do you feel, David? Wow, amazing. And do you remember this guy? Lady, what do you want? I think your Indian accent's good. So when I moved to Israel, David and Klein were my first two friends in Israel. Today, I'm taking them to an Indian restaurant in Yerushalayim. And let's see if they like Indian food in Israel. Let us see what we have on the menu. Hmm. Prices are pretty decent, I guess, compared to Tel Aviv. So this is David's Baby, second yeah. time. Yeah. How are you feeling? I feel very excited. We came to this restaurant and it seems very, very cool and very interesting. We have ordered, so I'm very excited and also very hungry. So yeah, I'm, I'm very anxious to see what will happen with the food and let's wait for it. <laughs> I also agree with everything you said. I've never had Indian food in Israel. However, every no single time really? I've had Indian food, I guess it's whether it's the States, I had it in Poland once too. It's always been good. So it has a lot to live up to. And also see all the decoration. It's very, feel very cool. Very hey? Indian look, the, the elephant. The We're going to eat an elephant is what he's saying. I feel in Tan Tag Mahal. Yes. Here you go. Yalla. Masala chai. Masala chai. To our friendship. I love you guys. Love you. Okay. Better days. Taste. It's very nice. Good. Very cool. <laughs> it's good for my nephesh, my soul. Nephesh shelly, I should say. <laughs> it is good. Wow. Wow! Mm. I can feel the masala. It's like an aftertaste of spicy thing. Very, very, very cool. I also love like how they gave us steel glasses. It reminds me of India so much. Oh, wow. That is pakora. Right? Oh my gosh, look at that. So here we have pakoras. Um, it's basically like a mix of onion, cauliflower, all the veggies, healthy veggies. But it's deep fried. And this is the green chutney, which is usually spicy. And this is the red chutney, tamarind chutney, Ooh. which is sweet. So just basically just pick one up and dip it. Not Sorry, one. I got first. Go for it. One. L'chaim. L'chaim. Indian falafel. I said it. <laughs> that might be sacrilegious, but I think it's Wow, true. it's super amazing sauce. Mm. It's very soft, actually. I wasn't expecting that. Is it too spicy for you? No. No. No, too spicy. Which chutney do you like the most? The green one. Wow. Are you, are you double living? I put double, yeah. I really have See? to say, they're the same. I like them both. Yeah? It's hot, fresh out of the boiling hot oil. Here's the chutney and are the other both? chutney with time. What do you feel? Is that sign language? What does that mean? <laughs> it's so good. Oh, okay. Yo, the taste is really authentic because it's very hard to find authentic Indian food in Israel and it's really good. Whoa. One more bite. I'm traveling to India very <laughs> soon now. <laughs> you are? Or was it a joke? I mean, I want to, but it's probably a joke. <laughs> So this is alu tiki, and this is, you see the, the red powder, that's the chili powder, all right? So let's do the taste test now, boys, just wanna, dig in. I want to get some of this. No, come on, go for it. Oh, I'm excited. Let's see. Look, I like, first of all, before we taste it, the colors and the, the yeah. I don't know, it's like an art. Right. Go for it. Yalla. One, two. It's cool. I'm not worth it's it. Like it. It's, it's a mix of of tastes like, I don't know how to describe it, but it's good. It's a mix of plus mamash taim, plus taim mayod. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm digging in. There you go, put some curd, and now, let's go for it. It's so delicious, you guys. It's like the perfect amount of chili and sweetness from the curd and sourness as well and it's so well cooked. I usually don't have curd or dairy, 
but I'm having it with aloo tikki and it's a really good combination. All right, this is our main dish, paneer tikka masala. With how how you call it? Paneer. Paneer tikka. Tikka masala. Masala. Yes. Paneer tikka masala. Yes. क्या बात है सर? क्या बात है सर? क्या बात ये बात है? This is our butter naan. Which I will not be eating. Right. So he is allergic to gluten. So we ordered steam rice, which he already ate like half of it, and I'm like, "Line, save it for paneer tikka masala." <laughs> so basically, guys, you just take naan or rice, okay, and eat it. Mm. Wow, super tasty. I know it's super special. I don't know how to describe. Wow. Mm. I need to get some cheese. Hold on one second. Eat the cheese. I want you to have the paneer. I also want the cheese. Let's see. It's super soft. I will be honest. I've only had this like frozen before. It like bounces back. Like if you were eating like squid or something. This is falls mm. apart. It's really good. It's amazing. Like the whole condiments here and with with the panini here. Wow. Delicioso. Really, it's amazing. I want to get more of the first two things we had. Do you want to do like a second round? I'm really full, and I shouldn't, but I kind of want to. So we'll see. We have dessert, so save. Space of Ooh, also, yeah. yeah. I can eat and eat and eat. No matter. It's time to revital to try the panini can masala. What are you talking about? Panini can masala. Because you're mad at me, but you're not allowed to eat. Paneer. Ah, paneer can masala. Tikka masala. Tikka masala. That don't say no, boy. Let's do a taste test. They definitely missed something. I, I agree. They missed like I can taste the paneer, but I don't taste the the tikka masala. Okay. I would rate this like two out of ten. Ooh. I do like the naan, as the Americans call it, naan bread. But uh, yeah, they could well, do better. Ooh. It, well, for me, it's, I I will give a nine out of ten because I think it, for me it's, it's very very tasty. I'll give it a uh, is it good? Five point three seven. Out of nine. <laughs> That looks delicious. Try it. Ah, it's tough. Like, uh, can I admire like... it at least? You can. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> nice. It's good. I like it. Is it too sweet? It's too sweet. Wow. Very sweet. I'm very very soft. Look at this. You don't you know? Hmm. I am excited because this looks really good. Ooh. Look at how fluffy it is. Yeah. Oh wow. Let's taste. Hmm. Interesting. It's nice. What is the ranking? I think it can be better. Okay. But it's a good attempt. Give give us a number. Oh, out of ten. Yeah. Uh, I think this is like six out of ten. Oh, low. It can be better. It's good. I mean, I'm used to eating like sweet. Okay. It's like the right amount of sweet. But I think can be softer, but definitely points for attempt. And we wait a lot of time to get to this. <gasps> All right, so I'm with the you. owner of Ichikadana. What's your name? My name is Nikhil. Nikhil, Nikhil yeah. you're originally from where? I'm from Rajasthan, India. Se Rajasthan. Okay, so how long have you been here? Uh, approximately uh, 12 years. 12 years? And you're saying a lot of Hebrew. Bhi kafi achha bol lete ho. Okay, what was the intention of opening Ichikadana in Jerusalem? There is no any intention. I'm actually in India. I used to work in, uh, to, with the tourists. But after I moved in Israel and I started to work in a kitchen, And so I have some motivation that I have to open some Indian restaurant in Jerusalem because most of the people they complaining there is no such a restaurant in uh, Jerusalem. So this is the re reason, very simple reason, to feed people with Indian food. I have to say yeah. we were very impressed. Thank you very much, appreciate. And we all know that we don't find authentic Indian food in yeah, Israel. But this was really good. Or your decor is also very desi. Hai. And uh, thank you for serving Indian food in Israel. We'll come always, once always, again and we'll recommend it to a lot more people. Always welcome. Thank you. Yes. I recently launched Moses in Israel memberships for an affordable price. This is a way to support me financially and help this channel grow. My members get first priority for video features, live stream replies and access to my personal posts. I frequently give my members a chance to hop on exclusive calls with me as well. If you love my content and believe in Moses in Israel, I would invite you to join my membership club. The link is in the description. You are literally a few clicks away from being a member of the Moses in Israel That's it for this video and I will see you in the next
time.